the life expectancy for Native Hawaiians is 13 years less compared to the Hawaii residents who have the greatest life expectancy in the state. 13 years, and you think about it, that's almost a lifetime, especially when you're looking at young children, that 13 years less of life is just an unacceptable gap that we need to address. Recognizing that need, the University of Hawaii at Manoa is now offering a new master's degree in public health, specializing in Native Hawaiian and indigenous health, the first of its kind in the world. Programs like this will help people to start to ask those questions of how they can do that better. At the event announcing the official launch, administrators from the Office of Public Health Studies and the John A. Burns School of Medicine celebrated the fact that the new graduate degree will create a new generation of leaders in indigenous health. Leaders who will address health disparities, work with policymakers, and create programs and services at the community level. The first graduates could come as early as 2014, and students entering the program are anxious to make a difference. Um, so I feel very strongly about helping, especially within like the Native Hawaiian community, to be able to um, advocate for their health and disparities because they have been silenced for so long. The statistics are staggering. The infant mortality rate for Native Hawaiians is twice that of the general population. The health disparities suffered by Hawaiians are mirrored by global indigenous populations, which total about 325 million people, or 6% of the world's population. Our work helps to create visibility by teaching scholars how to measure those health statistics that aren't necessarily going to come up in the broader numbers. It will take time, but the ultimate goal is to create a world where health inequalities for the future generations of Native Hawaiians and all indigenous people are a thing of the past.